is a presentation of HBO Sports. Hello, I'm Jim Lampley. Ukrainian Vladimir Klitschko has had a career which, to a certain degree, defines the ongoing questions that haunt the heavyweight division. He rose to prominence, looking for a while unbeatable, then crashed in a heap when he was hit on the chin for the first time by hard-punching Corey Sanders. Then there was another misstep against Lehman Brewster, and now Klitschko has risen again to once again become the main man in the heavyweight division. What a tumultuous career. Now let's take a look at boxing's greatest hits, Vladimir Klitschko. In 2000, Klitschko collected a heavyweight title belt from American Chris Bird, knocking Bird down two times. There's another knockdown for Bird. March 2003, defending his title against Corey Sanders, Klitschko was a clear-cut favorite. Hard left hand by Corey Sanders moved Klitschko back, and Klitschko goes down. But four knockdowns in the first two rounds ended his heavyweight supremacy. Another knockdown, the fourth time, and the referee stops the fight, and thus ends the Vladimir Klitschko Express. April 2005, Klitschko began to resurrect his career, taking on undefeated Cuban heavyweight Eliseo Castillo. Vladimir dominated the fight from the opening bell. And a good jab by Vladimir. comes in round four, and the referee's going to stop the fight. September 2005, Klitschko faced Samuel Peter in a title eliminator for the number one contender ranking. Two big right hands from Klitschko in the center of the ring. Peter hit Klitschko right on the back of the head with a right hand. Peter makes clear he's ready for an all-out war now. Third right knockdown of the fight for Peter. Vladimir Klitschko's technical skills begin to surface again. A very tired Sam Peter is finding it increasingly difficult to find Vladimir Klitschko. Oh, the left hook wobbles Peter! Going 12 rounds, Klitschko won by unanimous decision and gained the chance to battle for a title belt. April 2006, securing a heavyweight title matchup, Vladimir Klitschko squared off against American Chris Bird for a second time. Right hand by Klitschko, down goes Bird. Bird's in big trouble. Got hit with a massive left hook. Another left hook. He's open to the right hand. Vladimir didn't find him. Another right hand. A left hook. Bird hasn't fired back yet. Bird badly wobbled, having trouble taking the right hand shots. Bang. Right hand. Bang. Left hook. After a decisive seventh round knockout, Vladimir Klitschko was once again a heavyweight champion. On November 11, 2006, Klitschko faced off against the fastest rising American heavyweight, unbeaten Calvin Brock in Madison Square Garden. When Klitschko fought too cautiously for the first four rounds, trainer Emmanuel Stewart tried to bring some street-level urgency to the Ukrainian star's state of mind. You let them get too close, and therefore he may be winning the fight, believe it or not. Because you've been waiting and waiting, and now you're letting him punch, and you're just leaning in, doing this. You've got to start getting your distance and keeping him outside, and then you can catch him. You're letting him get confidence up too much. With Stewart's words ringing in his ears, Klitschko suddenly became a different fighter. And Calvin Brock has taken a beating in the fifth round. And a big right hand by Klitschko, and he thinks he's got Brock hurt. Vladimir going a little bit wild here, and leaving himself exposed as he knocks Brock down with a right hand. That was a huge punch, and it's going to be tough for Brock to get up. And Wayne Kelly's going to stop it. A knockout win for Klitschko in the seventh round. Boom! That's what heavyweights are supposed to do. To see more on Vladimir Klitschko, tune into HBO Sports. This has been a presentation of HBO Sports.